the movie Titanic it's up for release in 3d so what's the idea and thought like behind making this iconic film into 3d well we thought to ourselves if we were to make Titanic today we would have made it in 3d that 3d to us enhances the drama as more than it even enhances the action so when technology became around that allowed us to convert the movie we thought that the centenary of the sinking was the perfect opportunity. So this April is the time where we look forward to introducing Titanic to a generation of moviegoers who have never seen it on the big screen to show them why movies are special on the big screen and two, to allow people who fell in love with the movie before to go back and the 3D makes it as if they're seeing the movie for the first time all over again. So how's the response been like maybe from the audience, the fans of the film and of course from the lead actors? I'm sure you've shown clippings of the film to them as well. We, we have. The, the, the reaction to, you know, seems to be from everybody we've shown it to has been overwhelmingly positive. Uh, surprisingly, I think people are surprised at how much the 3D adds. I think people are surprised that the 3D doesn't bother them. And Kate and Leo, when we showed it to them, their first reaction was, oh my gosh, I don't look like that anymore. Because they haven't seen the film in 15 years, and to see themselves 15 years younger was quite a shock. But then they got over that. And when they got over it, I think they experienced it the way we hope everybody else experiences it, by going, wow, I don't remember that. It's like seeing it for the first time. So, but is this a trend sort of a thing in Hollywood right now? Because most of the iconic films or the blockbusters are being converted into 3D. So, is this like a, you're cashing on on a brand which is already there in the market? I don't, I don't think it's cashing in on a brand. I think what it is doing, if, if the filmmaker wants to do it, filmmakers are artists. And what they are going to leave behind as their legacy are the films they've created. In the future, a film that is in 3D is going to have more of a value to audiences. So if I'm an artist, I don't want my movies in black and white, I want them in color. If I'm, on, I'm an artist, I don't want a, my movies in color, I want them in 3D color. 3D movies in India haven't uh, done that well, except for here and there. But was the reason for you to promote a 3D film in India? Do you think India is an attractive market for 3D movies? I think India is an extremely attractive market, not just for 3D, but for all movies. I mean, Avatar did extremely well in 3D here. We did 29, you know, we did tens of millions of dollars here in business. Titanic years ago did 29 million dollars, you know, of, of business. It would have done more if it had been in 3D. I mean, I think that people want to seek that out here in India. I think that uh, it's a misconception. And again, don't confuse bad product with a, with a lack of interest in seeing 3D.